On this fine July day, in a small town, on this street at number 32, Jack lives with his family. Quite by chance, Jessica lives at number 34. Will these two children have the same career opportunities? Jack and Jessica are growing up together. They have become inseparable and are the best of playmates. I'm going to build dams like Dad, says Jack. And I'm going to work at the hospital like Mum, replies Jessica. Years have gone by. Jack is following in his father's footsteps. He will become an engineer. After originally considering a career as a nurse, Jessica settles on law. In Europe, 60% of recent graduates are women. But traditions and stereotypes influence education and career choices by women and men. In the health and education sectors, women make up 75% of all workers. These female-dominated economic sectors are less valued. Jack and Jessica now work for the same company. Jack manages large construction sites for the company. Jessica is a manager in the Human Resources Department. Both love their work, but Jessica's work is less prestigious. Her job is considered a woman's profession, less strategic and less visible. On average, a woman earns around 17% less than a man in Europe. Everyone agrees that Jessica is very talented. But this talent is not always recognised. For the same skills, invisible barriers created by prejudices prevent women from rising to positions of responsibility. Jack, the manager, travels a lot and often works late. Jessica is still waiting to be promoted. But after all, wasn't she the one who decided to cut back on her working hours? 78% or more than three quarters of part-time workers are women. Many years later, Jessica and Jack have reached retirement age. Jessica never had the chance of working full-time again. Her pension has been affected as a result. But Jessica knows that things can change. The European Union is taking action against the gender pay gap. It has adopted legislation to tackle pay discrimination. The European Commission is launching an information campaign to raise awareness about the causes of the gender pay gap and to promote equality at work.